Part of today's service for Aslan included presenting the colors and the folding of the flag. It's something that is done only by a select group of men and women in the military who in part train, perform and perfect the role of honoring those who have fallen. Our Melinda Zosh shows us what it takes to be part of the Malmstrom Air Force Base Honor Guard. What happens at a funeral is you'll have a flag open at tabletop, which is flat. It'll be open and um, you'll hear gun salute. Then this familiar sound is played. That's when the flag is folded and presented to next of kin. We try to make the flag as perfect as possible. Senior Airman Tyrone Mack is one of nine members of the Honor Guard here at Malmstrom. It's a lot of hard work, but it pays off. Airmen like Mac actually volunteer for this position. Then it's up to their leadership to decide if they're the right person for the job. Oh. Once they're officially in the Honor Guard, these men and women represent the entire Air Force when they pay their final respects to the fallen. Being able to give back to them what they gave to us, it, it means a lot. The Honor Guard is present at military funerals and presents the colors in various ceremonies. To Honor Guard Airman Jessica Ortiz Villa, this is her chance to pay the ultimate respect to her comrades in arms. Just thinking about that when I pass away, someone's going to be doing the same. It, it's honestly pretty amazing. It's not about me. It's about those who've done their time. It's about the families. Reporting at Malmstrom Air Force Base in Great Falls, I'm Melinda Zosh.